I love cloud software and um, you know the different changes. Uh, we've seen, uh, while I was playing around with Sway this morning, a couple of new cards to present content. Uh, one is the comparison card and the other one the slideshow card. So firstly the comparison card, I've just dragged a couple of pictures over from um, OneDrive and the comparison card you can um, slide between the two and compare the, the two different pictures. Um, quite useful if the two pictures are um, perhaps one after the other showing the difference in the, the shots or maybe a, an old and a new comparison um, of two pictures. And the slideshow, um, I've just been able to drag a, a picture of course over from OneDrive and add the different pictures that I want to show in the slideshow. And there are three different modes that we can use the slideshow in. So if we look at modify, we've got a thumbnail view, um, the single view of course, and then continuous. So we'll have a look at the uh, ways that these cards display. So first of all, the comparison card. If I had two pictures that were worth comparing, then I could slide between the two and see the differences. So that's quite nice. Um, our single view of the slideshow card means that I can click through and see those different pictures. If we go back to our storyline, let's have a look at what we can do with the thumbnail one. So this will show the slide that I want to show and also these thumbnails so I can just jump to the different pictures that are within the, my slideshow. And finally, if we change it to our continuous view, quite happily touching the screen away. So it's a continuous one and the pictures present across and, and beside each other so you might see more than one picture at the same time. So it's just advancing through the different pictures. And this seems to be the best one to show the full picture. So if I went back to the slideshow with, let's say, can single again, not quite showing the full picture, of course, so I could, um, let's see, can I click this and, no, that doesn't open up in a, in a, um, a modal window to show me the full picture. Um, but I did play around with the slideshow picture itself. You'll see that it has two stars over it, so that's when I can emphasize the picture. So I've expanded the slideshow, I'm clicking the picture itself. Um, within the slideshow and I can modify whether it's subtle, moderate or intense and I just want to see if this actually has any effect on the picture while it's within the slideshow and go back and it hasn't really changed the size so there's a little more work to do with this one I would find then that the the best view for the slideshow then is the continuous because it does show the full picture um, and I'm hoping to see some options to change how this card looks and maybe make it full screen. Let's just try one more trick. We've got the whole slideshow. Can we select the whole slideshow and change whether its emphasis is large or small? No. So that's where I'd expect to see the tool to be able to change whether it's one, two or three stars in size. Um, but yep, good new good new features. We'll give some feedback and see how it goes. Thank you for watching.